Hello everyone, this is Magical Witch and I am here to show you guys this awesome spell that you guys can do at home. This is a spoil me spell. Um, this spell is for those who are in a relationship. Um, this could be marriage or you are in a, re in a relationship, boyfriend and girlfriend or marriage. And you want your partners or your husband or your wife, anybody can do this, spoil you. Okay, um, to get you anything you want, to treat you like a queen, that whatever you ask for, this person will give it to you no matter what. This person cannot say no to you, okay? If you are interested in this spell, this is a perfect spell for you, okay? It's very effective, very, very effective. I've showed this spell from to, my, to many of my friends, okay? And... It has worked for them. Trust me, if you do it right and you have faith, this is a badass spell, <laughs> okay? Just to make a person do whatever you want, okay? So what you're going to need is a potato, two pieces of paper, cut the edges like I always show you guys, anise, and if you want wondering what anise is, in English... Anise, grand anise, Spanish anise, okay? You're going to need anise and you're going to need honey, okay? That is all you're going to need and two pink, red, or white. You can use either or, white pins, red pins, or pink, pink um, pins, okay? You're going to need a red marker if you want red or a red pen all right the first thing you're going to do let's set these items to the side really quick okay you're going to work with the potato you're going to cut the potato in half and you are going to carve the potato inside okay and as you're doing this you're visualizing that this person whatever you ask this person this person will give it to you this person is going to treat you like a queen so you say i want you to buy me a new car of course my queen i will buy you your car i want you to buy me a home of course i will buy you your home okay anything you ask you will get it anything okay you're gonna do it to both sides of the potato Okay. All right, and it's going to look like this on both sides, okay? Now, you're going to take the remains of the potato that you just carved off, and you're going to cut it in pieces, but as you're doing this, you are going to speak your intentions. John Doe, anything I ask you to do, you would do for me. You will grant it to me. You will buy it for me. Every time you go out and about and you see something that you know I will love, you will buy it for me and you will surprise me and you will come to me and you will think of me when you leave out of the house. Um, you will, you know, surprise me with flowers, whatever it is that you guys like, you know. So this person, when this person goes out and about and they see something and they know that you're going to love it, they're going to buy it for you. They're not going to hesitate. They're going to buy it for you and they're going to bring it to you and they're going to surprise you with it. So, if, and that goes like, you know, putting your intentions, you, whatever you say is what you're going to get granted for, okay? So, putting out to the universe, you are speaking your intentions and you are saying, you know, 
every time John Doe, you go out and about and you see something that you know I'm going to love, you're going to get it for me. If I ask you whatever it is that I want, you will get it for me. If I tell you that I want you to go buy me a car, you will get it for me. If I ask you to please, let's buy a home together, you will not say no. You will not hesitate. You will work hard to get me that house that I want. You know, anything you want, you're putting your intentions out there. Okay. Okay. After you do that, you are going to add your anise. Anise is really good to make the person grant you whatever it is. Anise is also sweet. Okay. So whatever you want. You want this person to be sweeter to you. So whatever you ask this person, this person cannot say no to you. Okay. Then you're going to add honey. Honey, 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 honey. You're going to add honey. Okay. So this person will never say no to you. And this person will be sweet, really sweet, very romantic, very lovable. That just going outside to the groceries, he'll buy you a rose, you know. He'll get you whatever you want. But you got to visualize and you got to speak your intentions as well. Okay. All right. It's enough honey. I got to add more honey. I keep, it's wasting. Okay. Now you're going to mix this mixture up. All right, mix it up, mix it up. And as you're mixing it up, you are speaking your intention. Now, it is good to use your bare hands when you do this because you're putting your intentions, you're putting your energy. Um, so as you're mixing it up with your hands, you are putting all your energy into this, okay? And you are going to be speaking your intentions. You're going to say, John Doe. Anything I ask you, you will never say no to me. You will grant it to me. Every time you step out of the house, you will think of me and you will bring me something. Anything I say, house, car, money, anything, anything you guys ask for, this person will never, never say no to you. Okay? And after you do that, you are going to set this to the side. Let me get a napkin. And the good thing about this spell, you don't need a candle. You don't need candles for this spell. I know a lot of people are scared to use candles, but this is one of the spells that you don't need a candle. Okay? All right. And you're going to work on your names. So now you're going to put his name or her name who you're doing this spell to. So I'm going to say John Doe, and his birthday is 7-6-1974, and then you are going to put Jane, your name, okay? Jane Doe, and your birthday is, let's say, 6-9-1974. Okay, and what you're going to do, you're going to put it face to face, okay, and you're going to hold it in your hands and you're going to visualize, you're going to be thinking about what you want this person to do, how you want this person to spoil you, okay, so you're going to speak your intentions, spend time with it. The more you, you speak your intentions, the more energy you're putting into your spell, okay? Don't just be like, and I want this, and I want you to do this, and I want you to do this, amen. No. You visualize it, you put all your energy, you squeeze it tight, you put all your energy into this, and then after you speak your intentions, you are going to take it, start off with him, and you're going to fold it towards you. Fold it towards you. Okay, and you're going to place it, first one, inside the potato. And with your hands, you are going to fill it out, okay, with your hands. 
There we go. We got one already. Boom. Okay. And you are going to do the same with yours. Fold it, fold it, fold it, fold it towards you. I'm going to place it on the other side of the potato. And you're going to fill it up. Same way. With your hands. Don't use a spoon. Put all your energy into this. Okay. There we go. And now, you are going to add them together. Okay. Add them together. And you're going to take your pins and you're going to poke it. There we go. It's warm. And that's two. Okay. So you got two pins and now you're going to take this and you're going to hold it and you're going to put your intentions you're going to ask mother universe to please help you um with this spell you know you're going to speak your intentions please make john doe spoil me treat me like a queen anything i ask Anything I ask this person to do, this person will grant it to me with no hesitation, without saying no to me, without thinking about it twice. This person will say yes and right away will give me whatever it is that I want. That when this person goes out, this person's thinking about you and will go and buy you some flowers or something that you said, oh, I like that. And right away they will buy it for you. Anything you ask this person to do, you want the universe to please help you or your ancestors, or if you're working with your saints, please ask them to help you with this vis with this um spell, okay? After you do that, you're going to speak your intentions. Hold on to this for a while. Don't just sit there and be like, I want this, I want this, I want, 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 no. You sit there and you visualize it. You think about it. You you close your eyes and you're already seeing this person that whatever you ask this person, let's go buy a house. Okay. Let's go buy a car. Okay. I need this. Okay. I need new furniture. Okay. I need this food. I boom. They give anything you ask this person to do. This person is not going to say no. Okay. After you do that, you are going to take this and right away, after you're finished, you're going to take this and you're going to bury it. Where are you going to bury it? Outside in your front yard, in your backyard, buy a plant and bury it inside your home. Go to a nice, beautiful park, green, bury it in a nice blossom tree, wherever you want to bury it. But this has to be buried, buried. Okay. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, those of you who are interested in any of my uh, spells, you can reach me at magicalwitch777 at gmail.com. That's magicalwitch777 at gmail.com. Blessed be everybody. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, people. Help a sister out and like the videos. The more likes I see, the more views I see, the more spells I cast and I will show you guys spells to do at home. Okay. Blessed be everybody. And I will see you guys in the next video. I love each and every one of you guys. God bless. Bye-bye.